and very good in the video on the brief answer question number 46 solution chapter la path to go number easy on a sum the first about the match area the absolute depression and freezing point of water for a particular solution is 0 0.093 degree celsius okay uh, depression and freezing point concept that the easy about you know 0 0.093 degree celsius and i reach depressed freezing point Calculate the concentration of the solution in molality and the solution or concentration of molality is given that molal depression constant for water is 1.86 Kelvin kg per mole. First depression and freezing point constant is another let's say for water and the tanni vandu normal ah namada freeze aachuna evlo degree celsius la freeze aagum 0 degree celsius la freeze aagum nammalu theriyum 0 degree celsius la Freeze out. If you have a little bit of 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 a NaCl add to the degree Celsius, that is minus freeze. So, the change in freezing point is delta Tf. Okay. This is the same directly proportional to molality. Directly proportional to molality. The molality is the number of moles, number of moles of solute divided by mass of the solvent in kg. Mass of the solvent in kg so in the low in the up pool of current the molality in the local career current number of moles of solute divided by mass of solvent in kg in the local current you can report the freezing point depressed the concept so but delta tf is equal to k of into molality molality value order or constant to multiply one now in the local freeze air to be change in freezing point on the normal character delta tf on the character so yeah so the calculation in a get a molality m get a ganga Molality M K uh, K F value K F is the molal depression freezing molal depression constant molal depression freezing constant and the cryoscopy constant and so on. So one point eight six Kelvin kg per mole but delta T F is equal to K F into molality. So molality is equal to M is equal to delta T F divided by K F. So 0 0.093 Kelvin divided by 1.86 if you look at the point 0.093 degree Celsius equal to 0.093 Kelvin. If you look at the point 0.093 degree Celsius equal to 0.093 Kelvin. Why? Actually, let's say one degree Celsius. If you look at one degree Celsius, we will go to Kelvin plus 273. Plus 273. 274 Kelvin. Let's say 2 degree Celsius. If you convert Kelvin to Kelvin, you can convert 275 Kelvin. Okay. Delta Tf is the same as 2 degree Celsius or 2 Kelvin minus value. Delta Tf is the same as 1 degree Celsius. Degree Celsius is the same as 1 degree Celsius or 2 degree Celsius is the same as 1 degree Celsius. Kelvin la minus pon 274 Kelvin ini 275 Kelvin ini minus pon ada, ini nada orang one Kelvin nada orang one Kelvin nada orang. So ada ini nade delta T F onde rendah minus pon ter value apuli ada orang, righta? Ini nih ya purunjuk tinggi na rambo isi anu bishen na. Ini nih ya purunjuk tinggi na rambo isi anu bishen na. Rendah minus pon number itu, ini nak de, orang ini value ada orang. So degree Celsius pun Kelvin nampu di equal. So change in freezing point onde. Plus two sama itu ni pada tebal lah. Just minus pun ambil tu, ada beberapa value tu, rendah lima, baru. Okay, so apa dia tu lah substitute pun orang kan? So 0.093 di Kelvin divided by 1.86 Kelvin kg per mol. Apa yang ada? Kelvin Kelvin cancel. So yang ada moles per kg. Moles mana lebih besar? So moles per kg. 0.05 moles per kg. Moles per kg ni ada molality. 0.05 m molality tu lah answer kita cuci. So calculate the concentration of the solution in molality. Okay? Ambil simple ane question na, itu mungkin perlu juru guna nak kira, where ada road sahaja ni nalo, kira komen section la potong ya, channel la kira subscribe panjang ya, elar ke, nama orang channel la kira abang kira dayu, teriye potong ya, so thanks for watching students.